everyone, Belinda here from Horror Tree, back again for another dose of my Horror Tree weekly wrap up. And today, as usual, I'll be talking about four submission calls that are currently up on the Horror Tree website, and I have an absolute cracker of a list lined up for you guys today. So without further ado, let's not muck around. Let's talk right into it. Okay. First up, the Die Laughing Literary Magazine, issue one. Now, they are looking for that sweet spot of horror comedy that is genuinely funny, but also genuinely scary. It can be as goofy, gory, or smutty as you like, and they want work that punches up, not punches down. Um, there's quite a bit to this submission call. They do have an unfunny list. They have things they'll accept, things they won't accept. So if this does interest you, please jump on the website and check it out because there is a bit more to this call than I can talk about. Um, they are after stories of up to one of between 1,000 to 5,000 words. So flash, short stories. They do have a soft spot for the ever cursed story region of between 1,000 to 2,000 words. Absolutely no AI and absolutely no reprints. Um, cover art, they are looking for scary illustrations. So for all you artists out there, get creating, get drawing. And payment is a token payment of $10 for flash stories, $25 for short stories and cover art, $30 flat rate. Submissions open on the 15th of July and close on the 31st of July. Okay, next up is Terracore Publishing Dolls in the Attic. Now, the style for this is it's set in the 1980s, 1990s. Um, genre is horror of any kind. It can be paranormal, slasher, psychological, gore, etc. There is no such thing as too far for this anthology. Now, there is a lot to this this um, submission call as well. So if this does interest you, please jump on the website and check it out. Or more details are up there. They are after stories of between 5,000 to 10,000 words. Now, payment is... Selected authors will wait, will receive a one-off payment of $20 and along with copies of the audio book, a copy of the ebook, and a contributor contributor's paperback copy. The submission window closes on the 31st of July. So the end of the month, guys. So a bit of get cracking if this one interests you. Okay, next up, Dead Set Press. Embrace the Silence, a, neuro, a neurodivergent anthology. Hooray for the Aussie publishers. And I have worked with these guys before and they are absolutely incredible to work with. So any Aussies out there, anyone who wants to work with Aussie publishers, this might be for you. Okay, Dead Set Press, Embrace the Silence, a neurodivergent anthology. Now, the idea behind this is... Embrace the Silence, the title of the anthology, refers to characters accepting and embracing their neurodiversity, as well as adapting to a changing and challenging new world. They encourage you to be as creative as you like in your approach to the theme. And as with the other two submission calls I've spoken about, same with this one, a lot to this submission call, guys. If you are keen, please jump on the website and check it out. They are after short stories of between 4,000 to 6,000 words, no reprints. Payment is $25 per story and submissions close on the 30th of October. And last but not least is the Orange and B. Now, the theme for this is they are interested in works that stretch, expand, test, subvert and challenge the fairy tale tradition. And like the other three submission calls I've spoken about, this one is a bit detailed as well. If you were keen, please jump on the Horror Tree website, check it out. But they are after poetry of up to 50 lines. They are up to flash fiction of up to 1,000 words. And they are up to short fiction, non-fiction of up to 4,000 words. Payment for poetry is US $50 per poem. Payment for flash fiction is a flat rate of $80 per story. So that's for thousands, um, a maximum word count of a thousand words. And short fiction, non-fiction is US 0.08 cents per word, 
max of 4,000 words. And the submission window opens on the 1st of August and closes on the 14th of August. And there we have it, guys. Another awesome week of amazing submission calls by amazing and awesome publishers. And hopefully there's something there that has grabbed you. And if you are going to submit, all the information you need is up on the Horror Tree website. Get on there, check it out. And if you are going to submit, all the absolute best of luck to you. If you are watching and you're liking these videos, please hit like, hit subscribe, hit share, hit comment, flick us an email, send us some feedback. We absolutely love hearing from you guys. And sorry my puppy co-host didn't join me today. They're destroying a teddy that I got them a couple of weeks ago and I believe yeah, from the stuffing I can see on the floor, they're, they're nearly finished. So, love that for me <laughs> and them. Um, but anyways, thank you again for watching, guys. And until next time, as always, stay safe, stay cool, stay spooky. I'll see you all later.